halfway through the treacherous Merrill Pass, Jack commits himself to reaching the top. But with the clouds hanging low, there's no margin for error. Alaska has more accidents probably per capita than anywhere in the United States. It's not comfortable knowing that doing the wrong thing could be fatal. Flying under the cloud line, he approaches the top of the pass and looks for a way through. I'm making sure that I got enough visibility that I can get to the top of the pass, about 3,400 feet. I'll let us get up there. He heads a little higher. Finally, at 5,000 feet, he makes it over and begins his descent into Antioch. When you have very poor weather, the worst thing you can do is panic. You need to play your cards right to the end, and you need to follow procedures, and you need to deal with the emergency. A little bumpy, I guess, um, about half the time, I think. And I just want to be so careful. This is, this is a great trip. These great pilots are good, uh, good to work with. Good people you trust. 12 year old Ilya and his dad prepare to head off into the bush. I have a shotgun because uh, you just kind of you have to have bear safety, and, and it's very good to be bear aware. But Jack has to get back to Anchorage. I think, Rick, that's it. Yeah, you have a good it. trip, okay? Okay, have you guys. He's got another group of tourists waiting to see some bears.